Well, hello everyone, and welcome to the next episode of the Shed Sessions here on Pokey Pidge. And as some of you may know, some of you may not, I don't know. I'm joined today by the the awesome, the very funny Nate Tube. You are right, Nate? Hello, hello. I am very well, thank you. Thank you for uh, giving me the opportunity, obviously, to be part of this one-to-one -one series. Um, I don't know, should I do a little introduction of myself, you know? Yeah, um, yeah. Let people know who you are, what you do, where you well, not wait, not where you come from, but you know. <laughs> I come from, from Earth. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, my first Earth person on the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, I, I'm I'm Nate Tube. Uh, you can just call me Nate. Don't call me a Nate. I get really triggered. <laughs> uh, I do a lot of uh, Pokemon shiny hunting, a lot of uh, Pokemon challenges. You know, like Nuzlocke stuff like that, and um, pretty much anything that's Pokemon, I probably do it. Um, and what else do I do with my life? Nothing. <laughs> what else is there to do? You, we don't need anything else in our lives. This nah. is it. <laughs> well, Pokemon is life, really, in, in my exactly. mind. Yeah. It's a religion as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, I mean, we should get that tattooed on us. No, that's, not. <laughs> that's just too far. Too don't far. tempt me, I will. <laughs> <laughs> I do have a Pokemon tattoo, actually. I've got a Cubone, a Cubone and Umbreon on my arm. Oh, awesome. I've gone for it. Yeah, it's not bad. I'll f if people want a picture, let me know in the comments. I'll find one. I'm not going to put it well. in the video. You don't want to see my arm. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, how are you just doing in general? You all right? Yeah, doing really well, thank you. Yeah, just um, taking every day as it comes, you know, enjoying life to its fullest. You know, yeah. if I've got nothing to do, I try and find something to do, make myself busy. Yeah. Yeah. That's what you got to do in life, really, got... isn't it? Yeah, well, we've got the lead up to Christmas soon, and that seems to be flooded with plans and places to go and people to see. So oh, let's make the most of it now. Yeah, well, don't remind it, yeah. me about Christmas. It's only oh, cool. November. I hate it when people put their Christmas trees up at the beginning of November, and I'm like, that is so sad. Why? Yeah, I'm, I'm all right. First of December, I'll get in the spirit of it. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. November's are pushing it a bit, you know? That is a bit, yeah. I mean, we haven't even had fireworks night, Remembrance Day, but yeah, let's get the Christmas decks out. That's all right. Oh, there you go. The, well, nothing to do with Pokemon, but the one good thing I do like about um, Christmas things being put up early in the shops is that oh you get all the chocolate early. You <laughs> yeah, get well, some nice yeah get nice Christmas edition chocolate in the middle of October. Yeah, fine. I'm I'm alright with that. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> well, don't mind me. I've already got an advent calendar and I've eaten like half of it already. So <laughs> oh there you go. Advent <laughs> calendar for November. They don't say what day it's for, do they? Right now, exactly. Exactly. Oh dear. Anyway, yes. Right. We'll go back to Pokemon. We're, we're, this yeah. isn't a chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Shed Sessions Chocolate Talk. I'll, well, to be fair, I'll be alright with that. But still. Um, yeah, you do you do Pokemon videos, as you've said. Do you know when your first video was? And what it was? It was... I didn't really start off doing videos, honestly. Um, I started off doing live streams. And I know that was yeah. on August the 10th, I think it was. Something like that. Oh, wow, yeah. Um, so yes, it's, it was, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so it's been just over a year now. Uh, but yeah, I didn't really do videos for a little while. I'm, I still haven't. I'm still slacking on the video front. But uh, <laughs> in terms of live streams, yeah, I just enjoy it a lot. I mean, it's, it's something I've been doing for, for a while now. I mean, I started off on Twitch. Didn't go too well, so I made the change to YouTube. And uh, I think I found a forever home. Yeah. Is it um, just fun building a community with people, to be honest? Just building up the regulars that come in and... Mm. just having some camaraderie about it yeah it's it's lovely i mean i've met so many new people through this platform it's just unbelievable i mean you being one of them um which by the way is an absolute privilege uh oh, well, thank you. <laughs> that's all right um yeah i've met a lot of new people a lot of new um community members you know and a lot of new friends as well i mean i've never really been the best at making friends in life so you know ever since i started youtube i've uh i've obviously made a lot more new friends and uh yeah it's really nice to be honest uh i can't say anything bad really no well in this modern world where we can talk to people that are hundreds of or if not thousands of miles away in different countries even it's it pays off yeah. it really pays off in this 20... sort of community yeah yeah 21st century yeah in a nutshell exactly yeah although to be fair with this particular uh episode of the podcast i think you're only about a 40 minute travel away from me right now from where i'm sitting so that's uh <laughs> well yeah about, talking, about that. Talk, talk, yeah talking about people that are thousands of miles away you're just down the road on a quick hop on a train so yeah, yeah well yeah cool. <laughs> yeah yeah why uh, yeah you said you went on streaming first i've mm -hmm. you know you 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 do a hell of a lot of shiny hunting a lot of people do and it, i love it i just love watching it it's... i just want to you know do you do you have a reason why you went to shiny hunting first and not not like um live streaming just like gameplay in general or challenges or anything 
Yeah, well, I mean, a funny backstory is, so the first Pokemon game I played was Pokemon uh, Pearl, and um, I didn't know what shinies were back then. I was like nine, so I didn't have a clue. Oh, okay. uh, and I found a shiny Piplup. It was it was just the first encounter. I didn't, wasn't even hunting for it. I just thought it meant it was clean or something. I, I didn't know what a shiny <laughs> was back then. Um, it had a shower. And then throughout the years, I saw, sorry, what was that? It had a shower. Oh, it had a shower, yeah. <laughs> uh, you know, using some of that head and shoulders and that, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah, so so I didn't know what it was back then. But then going through the years, I come, uh, I come across uh, some shiny hunters on Twitch. And um, I just started watching them, enjoyed the content. And then when they found a shiny, I saw how exciting it was. And then I, I, realized, and then I asked them, I said, what's a shiny Pokemon? I have no idea what they are. And they yeah. said, oh, basically, it's a rare Pokemon. Some games have like one in 4,000 chance. And I was like, ah, yeah. <laughs> I've released that pit plot. Ah, oh. <laughs> yeah. You, um, you hear of these stories often, don't you? Yeah, but then since Why then, is my mud kit purple? All of that stuff. <laughs> was my game broken? Um, yeah. But yeah, since then, I just kind of found a found a, a hobby for it, and um, I'm now slightly addicted, and I just can't <laughs> stop doing it. It's it's too fun. Also, ignore that voice crack. Yeah, it's a very <laughs> it's a very addictive franchise. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> well, yeah, that's the thing. I mean. I didn't think Pokemon was that big, especially in the UK. I didn't think it was as big as I thought it was. But when uh, Pokemon Center London came about, there was, what, hundreds oh, of thousands God. of people there. And I was like, is it really this big of a franchise? It's huge. Yeah. Six hour long queues. <laughs> well, don't get me started. The person in front of me was shiny hunting for, I think it was, uh, I think it was Reggie Rock on Omega oh, Ruby. Okay. Yeah. They were shiny hunting for it. And what's funny is not long before they got in, <laughs> I heard them scream because they were a little bit in front of me. And I heard them screaming, going, shiny Reggie Rock. <laughs> Everyone just like cheering. Oh, I'll brilliant. never forget that. That was brilliant. That was. That's fantastic. See, there's people watching this that maybe from, you know, from America where they might have a Pokemon Center within reach or at least a, distribut a distribution center in the country. We've mm. got nothing. We've yeah. got, you know, we have to order everything in. Oh God! We just need the shop like that there. Well, that's this is the thing that's annoying is is um, the Pokemon Center in Japan. They don't even deliver to the UK, which is which is so annoying, no. or anywhere in Europe for that matter. Um, so it's it's kind of annoying. But um, touch wood, touch wood, they might have realised. Hold on a minute, Pokemon's massive in the UK. Let's make one in London. Yeah, I'd be happy <laughs> with that. I'd do anything for that. Well, hopefully the reaction they had from when they opened it temporarily for that. I think it was was it two weeks? Was it? I can't remember. I think uh, it was yeah, I think weeks. it was a couple of weeks. Yeah, because it was uh, leading up to when Sword and Shield released. Yes, yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully, what they got from that was oh, okay, maybe at the very least get a distribution center in Europe. It doesn't even have to be in the UK. Just mm. you know, plonk it in the middle of Germany or something. I don't, but you know, as long as it's somewhere we can access it and get some stuff, that'd be good. Well, yeah, there you go. It's it's uh, yeah. it'd be a nice experience. Well, I'll tell you what. If they build one in London, that'd be the day I become homeless because I'll probably be living in my Pokemon. <laughs> like it's, it'd be everywhere. Yeah, I'd, I'd be poor. I'd have no money. <laughs> <laughs> uh, did you yeah. not? Did, did you not get tempted to take a, a device yourself and shiny hunt in the queue? See, I was debating it, but then I was like, "There's going to be loads of people there. Do, um, what happens if somebody steals my Switch? I got nothing to stream with anymore." <laughs> yeah, no, good point actually. <laughs> But um, oh, luckily, yeah. I got there. Luck luckily, I got there early, and then I found out there was a disability line. So um, oh, okay. I, I was a bit cheeky. I kind of got in first because obviously, with my disabilities and stuff, I, I was allowed to yeah. go in quickly. So didn't wait <laughs> more than an hour, which is great. But oh, that's pretty good. Um, then I'm still waiting around till the end though, because uh, they had because they had the Pikachu mascot coming down a few hours after I'd been in and out. Oh, so really? um, I waited around because I wanted to see the the London Town Pikachu. Oh, okay. Oh, that's not bad. They're huge, by the way. They're just like, like ten foot tall. How are they that big? I feel sorry for the person inside it. You know, <laughs> it's probably sweating <laughs> up a point. storm in there. Maybe they're just promoting Gigantamax in a very sort of weird way. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Let's have a look. Porygon, no. Bolton, no. Pelipper, no. And Cartana. Oh my God! Shiny Cartana! Oh my God! No way! No way! No way this has just happened to me. Oh my god, I was just saying how much I want a shiny Kartana. Look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello. It's my first shiny legendary. Oh man. 
Oh man, shiny Cartana, you beautiful, you. Ah, oh. <laughs> let's have a look. Let's have a look at his stats. Got beast boost, obviously. Um, what moves he's got? Vacuum wave, air cutter, leaf blade, swords dance. Oh my lord, that is amazing. Is there like a favourite video or a particular stream of yours that you've enjoyed more than others, or like a video you're proud of, or is there anything that stood out over the last sort of year and a bit? Um, you know what? I can't actually remember what my first video was. That's really bad oh, considering okay. I've only been doing it a year. But um, I, I, I probably have to say it's my Reggie Rock shiny reaction, just because that has, as far as I know, got the most amount of views. Actually, okay. no. I've got a better one. The uh, oh, right. okay. the shiny reaction for uh, Cartana, because that was oh. so unexpected, and I think that was probably one of the most natural reactions I've ever had, because, <laughs> like, it was the first Dynamax adventure. I wasn't expecting a shiny, and then it just it just popped up, and I was like... It took me a minute to realise <laughs> it was shiny. I was like, is that shiny? What does a normal one look like? I was putting oh, it on my right, phone, yeah. and I said, ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Well, no. hello there. <laughs> well then. <laughs> no, fair enough. Yeah, and oh, so that was on the, the very first one, was it? That was yeah. That was that was the first uh, raid that I did for it. It was a completely random one. I wasn't even hunting for it. So. Um. <laughs> well, if um, if I haven't put that as the first clip, that will definitely be the second. So don't worry <laughs> about that one. So that yeah, oh, fair enough. Um, I think I found your you know, found your channel from a shiny reaction of um oh I can never remember which lake spirit it was. I wanna say um Azelf? No, Mesprit. It, uh, must, got, it must have uh, been Azelf because I think that's the only one I've done out of the out of the lake tree. Yeah. Must have been yeah, it must have been because you it was a it was a double shiny reaction. That's right, that yeah. The, yeah, that's what yeah, that was the one I watched first. I thought, yeah, let's watch this, this sounds like a laugh. Yeah. Because, uh, yeah, I I got the gist from the video that you'd had a um uh, a bit of a bad, um, not bad, a bad luck stream. Not as in streaming, but like you know, streak. That's the word. Yeah, I'd be. I think I was yeah. going for Azel for about four or five months before I found the thing. Oh wow! Um, and then, it, and then, trust the after the after this bad luck streak, I, <laughs> I find um, what was it? It wasn't Swamper. It was um, Marsh Tomp. Marsh Tomp. That's the one. I couldn't remember what his name was. Um, <laughs> Yeah, it was a marsh stomp. And I was like, oh, oh my God, i got a shiny marsh stomp. Oh, brilliant. Finally, the streak Woo. is over. <laughs> oh, no. I was off for shiny. <laughs> and marsh stomp is such a great shiny, too. Yeah, well, I love him. He looks like a little blob of bubble gum. Yeah. I yeah, love that, him. That's, that's exactly a good way of putting it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if people haven't watched that, I'll try and put the... I'll, I'll put a card up if I've remembered to, and I'll, um, I'll even try and put the link down below to a couple... I always put a link down below for the specific videos i'll even put the link to the whole stream if people want to you know so go have a go have a look go check it out oh brilliant thank you that's all right you don't just stream now i've noticed from your work yo you said you forgot what your first video was i think it was um virtual fest i think i haven't got a clue without looking yeah. myself i can't remember now <laughs> i think I, it was it was so long ago that i, don't, I just don't remember um i think it yeah. was a virtual fest i didn't know what the heck i was doing throughout the whole no, blooming thing i was lost but there you go. <laughs> I was just like, yeah. let's walk around and see the cool Pokemon. What am I doing? <laughs> that's what I mean. You've yeah, you. That's something you've dabbled in. I've I've seen you. There's a there's a card opening on your channel somewhere. There's um, there's your surprise look as well. Yeah, there's that as yeah. well. Which I I'm still debating if I should carry it on or if I should just let it die now because it's been about a, I'd say about what six months since yeah. the last video and I'm just thinking like, I just call it a failed series and get on with it. i mean it's my first proper series so um yeah you know so i mean i wouldn't mind going down the route of, of you know cancelling it but because obviously i've got a lot more a lot more um projects coming up so i don't really want to kind of mix them in with that i want to kind of just focus on one thing at a time yeah no that's fair enough you could always sort of go back to it we've got Dime, brilliant diamond charming pearl coming out and saw uh, a surprise lock on that will still work as well if they've i'm sure they'll have a similar mechanic I hope they do. I'd be very yeah. upset if Wonder Trading aid on it because, yeah. well, they had it in the original one. Yeah, they did. <laughs> so, um, yeah, and if you, if you don't mind me mentioning, actually, um, for the uh, Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl, I'm actually doing a, a charity sleep lock on that as well. So, oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, you uh, go for it. You promote all you want. This is your, uh, this is your episode. Yeah, so I'm doing a, a charity sleep lock uh, for a charity called Bullies Out. 
uh, basically, uh, it's uh, basically what a um, a sleep block is. Pretty much is a nuzlocke, but you don't sleep. Uh, and then, yeah, so it's just the basic rules of a nuzlocke. You're not allowed to end until you finish the game, and uh, there's got to be some incentives that uh, people can obviously donate, which can either go for or against me, and obviously all the money goes to charity. Yeah, <laughs> goes without saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look out for that one. Is that um, brilliant diamond show and pearl? Did you say? Sorry, that's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, on, I'm, I'm excited on for it. Day? Yeah, on release day. Yeah, nineteenth yeah. of uh, November. Uh, yeah, three p.m. I think I said. Oh, that sounds good. I will be I will be joining in on that, as some of you guys should as well. Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah. I'll be in and out whilst playing the game myself as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hate playing a game on release because everyone's busy playing it, so they can't watch the stream. But, like, yeah. if I leave it again, long enough, then yeah. nobody's going to come in anyway. So <laughs> Then again, you've got the people that haven't bought it and want to see people play it. So, if anything, mm. there's a surge as well on a release date. Yeah, definitely. I've done, I've done that for a few games. Monster Hunter, I think, on the release date, because I'd got advertised it everywhere on, on my phone, laptop. Everything was just an advert for this. So I thought, well, maybe I'll like it. Yeah, well, I mean... I like watching that on release day. I mean, when when, uh, when the Crown Tundra released, uh, that was actually my most viewed stream so far. Um, oh, okay. Because uh, I think it was just because, obviously, on the day of release, I, I played through the whole thing. I did a sort of sleep block, if you like. And mm. then I realised the game was only, like, two hours so i was like okay cool i'll just shiny hunt summit for 22 hours um i really regret doing that because <laughs> i was out of it for a week I, I i'm not doing long streams like that again yeah no, no fair enough <laughs> apart from the sleep block obviously oh yeah the sleep block yeah but yeah. i doubt it's gonna be any more than like i don't know what 10 hours no nah, it should be all right Beat the game or go to sleep. I think that's generally the gist, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, yeah, exactly. Please don't donate. I want to go to sleep. <laughs> Have uh, you set yourself any sort of like goals for your streaming or anything? Uh, in general, I've set uh, a goal for the end of this year. I'm hoping, if I can be a bit more consistent, is reach 500 by the end of this year. But oh, okay. my overall sort of lifetime goal at the minute I just want to get my silver play button. That's literally all I want in my <laughs> lifetime. I don't want anything else. I just want the silver play button. Yeah, that would be good. I'm not here for the numbers, however. <laughs> however. However. Yeah. Well, the thing if is, the, like, yeah. my main goal really is just to meet new people and, and collaborate with as many people as I can, make new friends. And, you know, because cause streaming is just a hobby for me. Like, I'm, I'm not looking to pursue a career in YouTube. Like, I used to, but not anymore. Um, yeah. that's because I want to go down the route of uh, being a professional editor. So uh, okay. I kind of want to just use this as like, okay, I'm doing nothing. Let's stream. Let's make a video. Got nothing yeah. better to do. No, that's fair enough. What made you want to go down the editor route anyway? Um, you know, I don't know. All my life I've just been really into making videos. Like I used to, when I was really young, I used to, I used to just pull out my old little camera, uh, film a day out with my family and then just edit it together, put it on a DVD. Okay. There's a there's a home video for you, um, yeah. So it uh, just kind of got me into it. And I think also I did a course recently where I was uh, doing some filming and editing, and I, f I just felt like I enjoyed the editing part more than the filming. So oh, okay, oh that sounds um, alright. A lot of people say the editing part is the sort of most um, taxing and and yeah. sort of boring element, but that's sort of the point. It's 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 you very daunting. Yeah, it's very daunting. But um, I think I find it so satisfying when something times really well together. It just, it's just, it, it just, I find it satisfying. You know when you see those people doing all yeah. those satisfying videos, like where they're cutting this sand stuff and whatever. I'm there, like, no, nah, that ain't satisfying. No, nah. a video that looks good is satisfying. Yeah, no, definitely. Even if it's just you're editing and you, you're trying to get one transition right, mm. and you, and you try something, you watch it, and you're like, oh, like, yeah, that's it. I'm having that. <laughs> well, yeah, there yeah. you go. <laughs> That's the feeling. I know that feeling. Yeah, I agree with you on that one. <laughs> right, here we go. Let's have a look. Nope. Nope. The streak's over. Chat, the streak's over. Oh, look at you, you little purple blob. You look like a little bubble gum. You look like a little bubble gum. Bro! What the hell? No, 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 
No, no, no, no, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. No, oh my lord. That's the first time I've ever got a double shiny. And it had to be two fantastic shinies in one. And I have to leave one in the Dynamax lair. We just discussed some of your goals there, but um, I didn't know if you wanted to elaborate on the channel as a whole. I know you just said 500 by the end of the year. Mm -hmm. Have you got any other sort of mini milestones or anything you want to try and get to, or any not even just numbers, anything specific that you want to try and uh, try and achieve, or even the goals for the charity sleep lock in general, like a target for that or anything? Um, I think in terms of the sleep lock, I just want to finish it. <laughs> I don't care about it. I just want to finish it because it'd be my first sort of major event that i've done that i've actually completed because i i'm very famous for saying oh i'm gonna do a 24-hour stream and then i cut out halfway through or even a 12 hour <laughs> um yeah. but uh i, I want to try and get through the, the the sleep block because it just it would just feel like it would just feel nice to me like because i've done something good obviously to yeah. help out a charity um i think the milestone i said i was gonna set i started off at 100 uh, us dollars but uh obviously once i reach that i just increase it over time because if, if i say oh it's going to be i don't know let's just say a thousand dollars and i don't reach that then i'm going to feel a little bit rubbish so i thought okay if i set a goal and then just build it up over time yeah no but that I, sounds perfect yeah. i am hoping to get a grand at least on that though because um well it's just going to a good charity really nice charity to one that i fully support because obviously I, I i i'm linked to that charity really personally like they um they helped me out when I needed them the most, so oh, that's um, good, then. it's worth giving back, isn't it? Yeah, no, that's brilliant. Yeah, no, it's good to know that you, you know, there's people out there that don't just take; they also give back. So that's good to mm. know. Yeah, yeah. Have you um got anything specific for because your 300 milestones coming up? I think you're on 290 when I last checked, so it's, it's not that far like off. That. Yeah, yeah. So not Have that far. Anything anything particular sort of planned for it like a, you know even if it's a minor thing just like a specific stream or i'm not 100 percent sure obviously your plans i don't know off the top of my head i don't really think there's i haven't got anything sort of specific planned obviously as you know like i've got the um uh the charity sleep lock in uh well a couple of weeks actually yeah. um and then well not when this video goes up of course uh, and then uh in december as well actually i, I didn't even mention this one uh i haven't fully planned it yet but i'm 100% doing it all throughout December I'm going to be raising money for uh, the PDSA because uh, they were really helpful when uh, my cat passed away a couple of weeks ago um, and they were like really understanding of our situation they, they did everything they could before they said maybe the best option for her is going down the route that we did um, but yeah I just wanted to raise some money so I, I thought like instead of doing something specific for obviously 300 then uh, I just I just thought I'd just do a few charity charity streams up until the end of the year and uh, help other people out that help me out basically yeah now that's a very very good way of doing it mm, exactly yeah it's it's I, I never the thing is I never I never receive to give like I always give to receive no other way around i receive i give to receive <laughs> wait hold on i need to figure this out now that, I've, I've just messed it up completely don't think badly of me please <laughs> wait, everybody I, this I is cleverly edited <laughs> nothing give, is happening <laughs> i give to no I, I i'm just gonna give up with that <laughs> I, don't know, I, can't, I can't process anything oh dear you know whenever what I mean, you though. yeah yeah whenever you get anything you want to give back yeah, exactly. Or I mean, I, I want to give usually anyway, but like because it's yeah. something personal, I thought, okay, no, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do, go the extra mile for him. Yeah, no, that's definitely, definitely worth it. Save myself there. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's your plans for obviously 2021. Have you got any plans for 2022 onwards? Well, yes, I do actually. Quite a few plans actually. Uh, so. I think it's probably the best time to announce it. Um, so yeah. me and the wonderful Pokepidge are actually doing a Pokemon black and white... Uh, what is it? I forgot what it's called now. Uh, Soul Link. Soul Link, that that's the one. The one. Yeah. I was thinking Surprise Lock, but I was like, no, wait, that's my old <laughs> series. What am I on about? Yeah, so we're doing a Pokemon black and white Soul Link, which uh, I'm very excited to do. Yes, about, me uh, too. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's been my first sort of collaboration series I've done that 
hopefully we'll actually get to the end because every time we started when you know people's times clash and then it's just you know but i'm dead excited for this series first soul link i've ever done i'm still trying to get my head around the rules um it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, com- it's confusing here. to me because I, I think okay it's another slot but hold on so if that pokemon dies and that one dies if that one gets traded that <laughs> one gets traded what yeah. <laughs> like if, if my starter dies so does yours or if your first your root you know one encounter dies so does mine that's it gone yeah so you've got to think carefully like right who am i going in the gym with because if i go with this fire type you'll have your I don't know ground type and it might not work all that stuff oh god yeah, there's so much to oh, think man. about why have we done that now we've got to think about things <laughs> oh. oh no but uh, yeah no yeah yeah we're doing that that's happening in the new year yeah definitely I'll, i'm excited for it um i haven't got an exact start date just yet but uh no, i'm hoping fine. my aim is january but yeah um yeah and, and, I was, and obviously the way it all started out was um i was thinking of doing a collaboration with someone i met pokey pidge and i was like one do series yeah all right <laughs> and that was it <laughs> that, that's, that's literally <laughs> no word of a lie that was the conversation <laughs> it was like, do yeah. series yeah all right <laughs> yeah well i'd never been asked and all the people i would have asked that i knew before i, I met you of course they're all doing it with other people and i was like i don't want to be you know it, i don't want to make it sound like can i play too you know, I, I'm just like I'll let them carry on, and I'll I'll be a good viewer, and then yeah, I got that you know, we, you know, we got talking, and I got a message from me. I was like, yeah, 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 let's do it. Let's yeah, why not? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, it, I mean, and yeah, it's going to be a, a very good time. I think I'm going to be a, a hell of a lot more expressive in this series as well. Sometimes when I'm sitting in my shed on my own, trying to react to something, I don't feel silly, but sometimes it's difficult because there's nothing to bounce off. You just got a screen, a camera, and yourself. Yeah. But I think if uh, yeah, if you're working with someone, yeah, that's going to be fun. Yeah, because because obviously you know when one person something happens to one person, you're like, oh my god, wow, you know what I mean. Whereas <laughs> when you're on your own, you're just like, oh, okay, it's a yeah. it's a Rayquaza, cool. <laughs> okay. like, oh my god, Rayquaza, there's no one to share this experience with, <laughs> except for all of you viewers at home. Um, yeah. <laughs> let's not forget about them; they're still here. <laughs> yes, they are still here. Yeah, your guys are still here. We well, will appreciate them. Let, let's hope they are. Anyway, um, <laughs> I've, pro- I've probably bored them to death by now. Nah, you're good. <laughs> yeah, so that yeah that'll be in the new year, guys. Yeah. Little bonus announcement in this lovely shed sessions. And I, I'm just I'm so excited for it. It's because uh, I'm always doing series and stuff with with one specific person. It's nice that I can kind of broaden my horizons a bit and meet new people. I mean, yeah. collaborations is the way to go, really. You know, meeting new people, especially in you know, the community that you're involved in. Yeah. So, oh, the, the, yeah, the Pokemon community is fantastic. I've met so many friends from this. Oh yeah, definitely. I think I've met so many more because usually I, I'm well known for meeting more enemies and friends, but uh, <laughs> luckily the Pokemon community is the opposite. Yeah. They are there to put an arm around anyone. I think it's, it's a community of people that um, possibly in their childhood, you know, liked a bit Pokemon too much. Maybe were a, a bit bullied, were out of the popular group, all that stuff. But now that they're mature adults and they still play those things, we sort of congregated together and attracted together like magnets. And we're like, hey, yeah, let's just all, t- you know, forget the world. Let's just make use of each other. Well, yeah, exactly. I mean, I was personally bullied for, for liking Pokemon, which is the reason why I stopped liking it at one point in my life. But... Uh... Yeah. I don't know, I got out of school and I was like, yeah, po- Pokemon is, is still pretty sick. I don't, I, I don't care what other people think. I'm gonna I'm just going to pursue it. And, well, now look at me. Yeah, Doing nothing exactly. better than looking for sh- slightly different coloured pixels. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> with slightly different um, graphics that have slightly different stats with them. <laughs> it's all just a numbers game with some fancy graphics on, but it's great. Yeah, exactly, yeah. It's it's great. It is great. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Have you got um anything else in twenty twenty two lined up? I don't know if you're thinking that far ahead yet, because obviously you still got stuff to do now. Oh God. Um, I can't even think about tomorrow for crying out loud. <laughs> so I, <can't, laughs> I don't know what's happening tomorrow. Um, no, I think I think in terms of our series, I haven't actually got anything lined up just yet. Um, I hope to obviously soon, because I know I I usually do like an end of year, uh, kind of recap and then like what what to look forward to in the next year i kind of like to do that on, oh, okay. That's cool. on new year's eve actually uh, yeah new year's eve um so yeah I, I think it might be nice to uh yeah I, I think i should start thinking about those things now to be fair it's already november 
Yeah. <laughs> Where's this I, year yeah. gone? Where's this year's just gone? I have no idea. <laughs> well, it, yeah, we're already a week into November. I'm still feeling like it's October. Yeah, I, I don't even know. Oh, I don't want to know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to think about it. Oh, God. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. Let's let's get this year done first. Let's get this one done. Mm, yeah, definitely. And then people can watch us play black, white in the new year. I assume one of us on black, one of us on white. That could be fun. Yeah, that'll be good. Yeah, and obviously randomize as well because you, you can't do it. Yeah. Oh, I refuse to do a nose lock that's not randomized because yeah, it, it just removes the fun. Like, oh wow, it's a ratata. I would never have known. <laughs> you know, it's yeah. a, a randomized. Oh my god, it's a it's a hoo. What? Why are you here? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, that's like, hence why you've done the surprise lock on, um, uh, uh, on I don't know if it was Sword or Shield, but on Gen 8, I suppose, uh, because was... that's the random element of it. Yeah, yeah, that was the kind of randomised element, but uh, it was annoying when I kept getting uh, hack shinies, but there you go. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but, I, but I thought, I can't, I can't be bothered to look out for the hack shinies, because once I've done this series, I'm just going to delete the account anyway. Yeah, no, so, fair enough. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Except for that shiny Eevee, I still kind of got that, and I still kind of gave that to my nephew, but there you go. Ah, that's all right, then. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> well, yeah, there's nothing else to say now, apart from thank you for coming on to the episode, whatever number it is now, which said Sessions 5. <laughs> I don't know. I've lost count. <laughs> I, I, I don't even know, to be honest. <laughs> God knows. Is there oh, anything yeah. you want to... I know we spoke about it, but is it, you know, anything you want to promote? I don't know if you have merch yourself yet. I don't know. Anything you want to say now? Or is it just sort of the charity stream you want to really um, drill down on? Yeah, I think it's really just a charity stream that I want to try to try to get as many people in it as possible. Um, like, it's not even like for the donations. Like, just getting the support will definitely help push me up the ladder a little bit and get more people in who might be happy enough to donate. But I've always said to people, even if it is for charity or if it's just donating to me, like, never think that you have to donate. It's not something you have to do. Um, my content's always free you know I, I, I don't even I don't even do it for the money I don't do it for the views I just do it because I've got nothing better to do really <laughs> it's kind of a sad way to put it but there you, you go do it for the joy I do it for the joy especially when for I find those shinies that I've spent months looking for um, yeah and obviously in the long run <laughs> yeah and, and obviously I really appreciate uh, you as well Pokey Pidge for inviting me onto the uh, the shed sessions because uh, I've been enjoying the series so far even though I did kind of watch them all through like an hour before we started. Um, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, but I do appreciate you uh, inviting me onto the onto the shed, uh, shed sessions. And honestly, anyone watching this video, please go and go and show all the love to uh, Pokey Pidge because he, he genuinely deserves it. You know, I, I met him. I, I thought, oh, it's another PokeTuber followed me. Let's go and watch his content. And I tell you what, I've not ha I've not had more joy watching any PokeTuber in the world besides him. Like I oh, I can't stop well, watching his videos. That's all right. I, I was binge watching your videos the other day, actually. So oh, well, that's all right. I, I was just like, oh, recommended. Let's watch this one. Okay, let's watch that one. Okay, that one's finished. Oh, watch this one. All right, cool. I'll watch that one and all. You should see how many I got in my watch later as well. Oh, there's a few. I've been doing it four years, but for about three and a half of those, I only had about fifty subs. So that's well, yeah. there's a lot. There's a lot of content people haven't seen yet. So I yeah. might just start posting old videos. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, well, yeah, no, thank you for joining. And obviously, goes without saying, like I said at the beginning, check out NateTube as well for everything we've just said over the last 30 to 35 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you're still you. here, yeah, if you're still here now, obviously you're interested. If you haven't subbed, go and do it. Thank you. But yeah. yeah. Praise well, thank you the again. Pokey yeah. Pidge. I'm... <laughs> exactly. Yeah, thank you again for joining and that'll be it from us. So we shall see you on the next episode. I haven't got anyone else planned yet. So that's oh. exciting actually. I can go and I can go and sort that out now. But yeah. Good idea, thank it? you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you everyone and see you later. See you everyone. Take care. Thank you for watching this video. I do recommend the couple I put on screen now. I've got the little subscribe circle. Click it if you want. Well, click something.